Hey guys, I'm going to show you an exercise to help build up some strength uh, and aggressive pop for your uh, your head snaps. Right over here we got the big boy, we got a hundred pound dumbbell right here. It's rubberized, that's not cast iron. You can use cast iron if you want, but the reason we're using uh, rubber on this particular one is we do want a little bit of a bounce. Make sure you're not, gouge, not gouging concrete or anything out of your gym, or as you can see, more often than not we take it outside even though it's a little bit chilly today. Now. These are going to be one arm dumbbell rows, but we're not trying to do nice and slow and steady. We're not trying to look good. Looking good would be nice, but hell, I've been doing it for so long and I still don't look good. What we're trying to do is give you a nice aggressive pop so you get some constant motion, uh, uh, a constant aggression whenever you're doing your, uh, uh, your head snap series, which we've been running again and again on that raw, on the raw material. Uh, whenever we're running the head snap series, we want this to be nice and fast, fast, fast the entire time. So what you're going to do is don't have any specific... Uh, uh, repetition numbers in mind, you're going to just pop this from floor to chest as hard and fast as you can till you can't hit no more. Then as soon as that's done, switch to the left hand, do the same thing. Walk around, take yourself five deep breaths, come back and then blow out that right arm and the left arm again. Walk around five deep breaths for a total of three sets. Now this is the kind of thing you're going to use before you run right into most of the other uh, intense material, uh, but this is just to get you ready, mainly to make sure we're ready uh, hard and fast for that one-handed head snap and we're pulling it in. Again, we're wanting to make sure when you're doing a head snap, it's not slow pressure, it's hard and fast. So you're going to be bouncing this off the ground and off your chest. I'll probably just give you about a dozen repetitions here of the aggression I'm talking about. Take yourself a wide stance, grip that dumbbell, and stop. Like I said, optimally, you're going to go until you blow out. Uh, if you find yourself hitting around 30, 35, 40 reps with uh, both arms before you fall to pieces, good for you. Uh, you know, 10, 12, 15, pretty respectable, but I think you can probably hit higher than that. Going with a low weight on this, not replicates the, I find it doesn't replicate the force you're going to need to really throw into uh, your head snap. So if you got a, a hundred pounder, great. If you got something lower than that, fine. Just use the heaviest thing you got. But, I think the 100 pound minimum is going to be best for you big boys out there. Go more than that. You anyway, have fun with it.